One of the best feelings in the world is when you get that nut. That's a beautiful feeling. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Woo! Man, you a crazy ass nigga, dog. Should married women have male friends? Man, should married women have male friends, right? Yeah. I'm just going to say this, man, because I'm not going to speak for for every for every woman that's married. You know, when I had gotten to my when I first got married, you know, my wife made it clear that she don't believe in, you know, female friends. She told me this. Now, she said the female friends you have. You better get rid of them hoes. And I didn't understand that because I'm a firm believer of you don't know, you don't really know your wife, your spouse until, until you know, you're married, you know, right? right? Not before you married, you know, after. So, you know, uh, I learned a lot about my wife, you know, after I got married. And I didn't understand that. I did not understand why she said that. You know, that I don't believe in, excuse me, female friends, bring them to the house and all that. Now I do. So, you know, should you, should married women have, you know, have male friends? I'm going to say no, man, because I don't want, you know, I don't want to be at work. You know, I'm at work and I'm calling my wife and she don't answer the phone. And she sent me a text. She see me calling and she sent me a text saying, uh, bae, I'm going to call you back. I'm on the other line with Tyrone. Now, we got a problem. You know what I'm saying? Damn, yeah. That's, yo. Yeah, yeah. He, yeah, he telling me I something very important. Saying. You know, and I, I tell you about it later. Look, we going to, we going to, you need to answer that phone when I, so, you know, for me and mine, you know, I, I just feel like, you know, uh, Male friends, no. You know, my wife, uh, we had that talk. You know, nah, you're not having no male friends. Them niggas that, you know, that you knew before me, you're going to cut them niggas loose. Now, I have been in relationships before, mm-hmm. you know, uh, you know, girlfriend, boyfriend, you know, where the female, you know, what the female say, um, my girlfriend at the time, she said, uh, you know, nigga call. Who who is that? You know, oh, that's my friend, such and such. Oh, okay. You know. Uh That's all you said. Okay. The next day. Well, that, that ain't my wife. That's that's my girlfriend. You yeah. know, so you know, I'm like, what can I say? You know, the nigga probably been there for years. I just got in the picture, you know, and that's just my girlfriend or somebody I'm dating. The next day, her phone ring or she getting a text. Damn, who is that? Oh, this the other nigga. So, look, that's a hard one, man, because a lot of women believe that, nah, man, you know, I, I've been knowing this guy for years. We friends, you know, and we going to stay friends forever. This guy know my whole family. You know, this guy know my kids, you know, and you just came in the picture and you talking about I have to lose a friend because of you? So, you know, it, it just depends. Now, me, again, me and my wife, we don't believe in, you know, I should have female friends and she should have male friends. You know, we don't even, we don't play that shit. You know, she don't, she don't have women come to the house. She don't have female friends anyway. Now, you know, uh. You know how I feel about the word friends. I don't believe in that. Don't get me wrong. You know, I do have, you know, friends. I just say that because I really don't have friends. The the the, the two or three people that I know that consider my friend that I say that's my friends, they like brothers to me. That's why I don't say friends because I don't believe in friends. So, right. You know, she don't believe in male friends. I don't believe in female friends. You know, and it just 
it make the marriage more better. You know, it keep down confusion, the stress. The stress, you know, all that. You don't have to worry about, you know, no bitch calling my phone. I don't got to worry about no whole ass nigga calling your phone. You know, so to answer your question, you know, should married women uh, have male friends? I'm going to say no. Okay. I'm, um, I'm going to say this. You know what I'm saying? My younger day, my younger early, you know, with my wife, you know, it was girlfriend, boyfriend. It was, I'm going to be real with you. It was hard to, you know, let some of the people that I knew way before her, it was hard. It was it was a big pill to swallow because it was like, damn, they didn't do nothing to me. You know, they were just old friends. Like, okay, you know, we used to hang out, chill, you know, da 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 And um, it was hard, man. And I have to, you know, understand the only way that I was going to make this relationship work. And, you know, I do the right thing, you know, the most responsible thing was to cut some people off, you know what I'm saying? Uh, old friend, female friends off. So, you know, it. if you're looking from a perspective as, okay, you've been with your wife, you know what I'm saying? Let's say 10 years, but you know such and such for about 15, 20 years. So the person you know for 20, 20 years knows you, know you a lot. More, this, this is just say more than your wife do. But then it's like, okay, you wish your wife, now you're married, now it's time to cut loose of some friends. You know what I'm saying? And you know, I'm be, it was hard, but it's all about being responsible. And you know, and it's the right thing for most people to do. Married women, having male friends, you know, and I'm looking at it, okay, how would I feel? How would I feel, you know, if I know that my wife have a male friend? I'm at work, and I, you know, you know, you you catch anxiety. You you thinking too much, like damn, what? Are, you answering the phone, okay? You gonna keep blowing the phone off the hook, and then you might think, what you doing? I was in the restroom. Oh, okay, you know, it, it draws a whole bunch of paranoia. You see what I'm saying? It makes you paranoid. And, you know, that's why it's not good to really have friends. I'm speaking on both sides because let's be real. You know, you hanging out with your friend and you, you going out for some drinks and some lead to another. Right, and then, right, right, right. You know, that's going to be a big problem. You know what I'm saying? So I can understand that. But I'm going to say... No, I don't, you know. Okay. I don't, I don't agree with that, man. So even if your wife, or at the time, wasn't your wife, like you you first met her and you wanted to, you know, take it to the next level and she say, look, I'm just letting you know, you know, I have a friend that I've been knowing a long time, this male friend, would you, I need you to accept that, but you really like her, would you accept that? I have to accept it. You know, I have to. If 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 I know this is gonna be the person that I'm gonna spend the rest of my life with, I have to appreciate, you know, whatever comes out of her mouth. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Um, you know, we we actually have this had this discussion before about, you know, it wasn't like no disrespect. Like you don't it just as far as a certain limit to having friends. Like, okay, maybe your friend can have a date and we can all go out. We talking about yeah. male friend. Well, yeah, yeah. I'm just speaking as, you know, a scenario. You know, if that come down the line for to help somebody. But, you know, um, that's the only way I can see people having friends. Women having friends. So you don't friends. mind your wife having a male friend? But he was before no, you. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. That's what I'm saying. You When you first yeah, met yeah, your yeah, wife I feel you on that. and yeah, she asked I'll you speak, and she yeah. tell you, look. I've been knowing, uh, you know, I've, I've been knowing, you know, Brandon, you know, for five years. And he know my whole family and he's a good guy. Matter of fact, he's engaged. Now, he's my friend. And it's going to be some times when me and him on the phone while you calling. And I might have to tell you I'll call you back. Yeah. Oh, now. 
Zip it? No. See, it should be vice versa. It's, no, it should be Brandon Awakai. You bet my husband is calling. Now, you know. Now, you say on that note, nah, that ain't going to work. But but you will respect that your wife has a male friend because you really want to be with her. Well, you know, you really want to. Nah, I ain't going to say your wife, man. but, you know, your girl Yo. girlfriend. It just it's a hard pill to swallow, man. <laughs> so And then she tell yeah. you, you know, they slept together one time back in the day. Oh nah, that's it. Nah. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Yeah, you know, the, 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 yeah, the nigga nah, had uh -uh. the nigga had her uh ankles, you know, by his shoulder. Nah, uh uh. I, I ain't having that, bro. Okay. I ain't having that. No, sir. And that was a long time ago. I uh... Hey, you seen hey, you seen best man. <laughs> Yeah, man, that's some real. That's real life, man. So the answer, so you just know for you, no. you know, should mad women have male friends? You say no. No. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go. Bro, this twenty twenty one, man. You don't Everything even know changed. if you want to be a Christian or eat a bean pie. Man, <laughs> Come on, bro. Hey, man, look, I'm, I'm researching, bro.